Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Also, this is gonna be a week in my life. Today is Monday, and I wasn't gonna film today, but I thought, you know what, I would do a week in my life because I really enjoyed doing my last one, and you can kind of see a collection of days, and I feel like it's a little more interesting because I feel like I do the same thing um, in a lot of my vlogs, so I'm trying to change it up a little bit, but I have a Trader Joe's haul for you. Now, I'm not gonna do like a full haul of what I get because a lot of stuff I get all the time, but I picked up some new items that I'm really excited about, and as I was like putting my stuff away, I was like, oh my gosh, like I got so many new things that I think are gonna be really good, so I thought I'd show them to you, and yeah. The first thing that I'm really excited about is this pre-packaged Waldorf salad. Now, Waldorf salad is probably my favorite type of salad ever. Like at CPK, the Waldorf salad is so good. I love like a summer salad, and this is new. I haven't seen it before, so I'm really excited about this. I will probably be eating it this week. Well, I have to because it's gonna go bad but I will let you know how I like it. The next thing that I picked up that I've already tried and I am obsessed with is the pumpkin cream cheese. This on a bagel, specifically everything bagel. You might think I'm weird, but I love like the sweet and salty and like a really toasted bagel. Oh my gosh, it is, it'll change your life, I swear. So pumpkin cream cheese, you should try this out for sure. Another thing I was really excited about that I haven't seen, but maybe they've had them for a while, but I've never bought them. They're just like by where the rest of the eggs are, are the turkey bacon and cheese egg bites. Now these look like the Starbucks ones and I'm pretty sure you just put it in the microwave, but I'm really excited about this because I feel like these would be really easy, like on the go snack or just like if I'm lazy. Um, and then another thing I've been loving is this sesame crunch chopped salad. I actually put this with some tuna salad in it and it sounds really weird, but it tasted exactly like health nut. Um, if you live in the LA area and you've tried health nut, um, this with the tuna salad in it, it tasted really like it, especially with the dressing. So definitely recommend that. Now a sweet treat is or these i always have loved like getting these from candy stores and like delis and stuff um they're i don't even know non-perials what are these called i don't know it's like the chocolate like snow cap things but they're with dark chocolate guys this is so good and i couldn't resist and i had to get it and i've already had to another thing that i got were like, I hate keeping chips in the house because I just feel like it's dangerous um, thing to keep in the pantry because like the bag will be gone within two days. But so I found these and they're these like little bags of um, nacho tortilla chips, basically tastes like Doritos. And if you want like, if you're craving chips, I think this is a good option. But yeah, that's really all I wanted to show you just a few items to look out for on your next Trader Joe's trip because I'm really excited about these and you will probably be seeing me eat some of these things in this vlog. So as I eat them all, you know how I like it. The things I haven't tried, but yeah, that's that. And later tonight we're going to dinner and I'm trying to think what else. All right, I'm getting ready for dinner. So I thought I would just a little bit. I'm trying to decide how I want to do my makeup. I'm just going to do concealer. But yeah, today was kind of a chill Monday. I mean, I was productive this morning, but I don't know. The nice thing about like working from home and being home all the time is, I don't know, you just don't, like, don't have the stress about like being in an office all day and then like driving home and sitting in traffic like it's actually been really nice to be able to be home and be on my own schedule but I actually I mean I do miss like going into an office and being productive and socializing with people and working and it's definitely different but I feel like this is going to be a new 
way of living for a long time, so it's like have to kind of adapt. Yes. Um, but a question I have for you guys is what kind of videos you like of mine? I think by now I've posted like a wide variety of content on my channel like i did vlogs i did home decor i did fashion and that's kind of because i have so many interests and that's why i really wanted to start a youtube channel but i love a variety of things and um that's why i love youtube because i can kind of share that and express like my creativity however i want um but some of the youtubers i watch like if you're curious are brooke michio um Danielle Carolyn, I really love, I've been loving Bianca Franco. She is one that I discovered recently. I think they're for like wedding videos and I feel like we're just kind of like at a similar stage in our life. Like she's getting married this year and she um, lives with her fiance. They're like getting a dog and I really love seeing her videos. So I definitely recommend checking her out. Um, really like watching more Elizabeth. I love, oh yeah, Julie Havens, I've talked about her before, she's probably my favorite, I just, I literally, I'm, I have like a YouTube crush on her, I swear. But yeah, if you need like other YouTuber recommendations, there's that. So I wanted to show you guys what I'm wearing real quick before we head out the door. Um, top is from Zara, it's just like their basics. I love these, I have it in black also and I definitely recommend this jacket is from Brittany Melville. I think I showed it in my last vlog. And then these jeans are from Zara, which I love. They're the um, wide leg high rise, I believe. I will definitely link them down below. They remind me of my Eagle D's. I really recommend. I recommend also sizing up in Zara jeans. I'm normally like 29 or 30 and I get a size 10 in these. So I don't know if that's helpful for you. But, and then I'm just wearing my Air Forces. So yeah, we're gonna head out, but I will see you guys later. So I'm home now and I thought I would just let you in on my nighttime routine and my skincare routine. It's really not anything crazy, but here we go. morning guys um as you see i just made myself some breakfast and i can decide between the egg bites or bagel because as i told you guys in the last clip i am obsessed with this everything bagel with pumpkin cream cheese seriously try it 
you won't be disappointed. It's the best thing ever. Um, so I'm having a half bagel with pumpkin cream cheese and then I heated up one of those egg bites. So I wanted to try it out and see what it's like. I really like the ones from Starbucks. So I'm hoping I like this one. Honestly, it's really good. It does taste really similar to the one at Starbucks, the like bacon Gouda one. It's really like cheesy and flavorful and has a really good texture. So definitely recommend picking those up. And it was super easy. I just microwaved it for a minute and comes with two, but I just like cut the package in half and just popped one in the microwave. Actually, I wanted to show you guys this mug. I don't know if I've showed you it before, but my sister got it for me for my birthday. It says the one where Sydney gets married. So cute. But yeah, I'm going to eat my breakfast and then we'll talk to you guys a little later. Hi guys, it is a little while later. It's actually 2.30 now, so I'm going to have some lunch. I wanted to show you because I want to try this Waldorf salad from Trader Joe's. Um, I told you guys in my Trader Joe's haul that I would be like trying these out throughout the week. So I just thought I would do a little taste test, but it looks really good. Let's see. That's pretty good. So I'm gonna eat this while I get some work done, but I wanted to update you guys on, we just had a call with a uh, musician, like live band for a wedding. And then we have a call with a DJ in a little bit. And yeah, I'm really excited that we're starting to book more of our vendors and get that situated. Um, so that's all really the update I have for now, but I definitely- Good morning guys and happy Wednesday. Um, I just got up not too long ago and I haven't really had coffee. So if my voice sounds like this, that's why. Um, but I'm gonna go actually walk to a cute coffee shop down the street from me and pick up a coffee. I just thought it'd be a good way to get outside, walk around, um, and I haven't been there in a little bit and it's really cute in there. So I'll show you guys that and yeah, no big plans for the day, but just need to get coffee so I can be a normal human being. <laughs> and it's honestly a couple hours later I cleaned up um, the rest of my apartment a little bit but I highly recommend doing that like if you just need honestly I just need like a break and you take a walk I just needed to like start my day off differently <laughs> because every day is the same um, so yeah that was really nice and I just like listened to a podcast on my walk and then sat there drank my coffee had a croissant highly recommend but Okay, now we're in my closet. You're like, probably why are you standing in front of your closet? Um, this is thankfully my closet. Aaron has his own closet in the office, but they're actually his actually might be bigger. But yeah, this is um, long overdue. Like I said, I've been posting a lot of stuff on my Poshmark and I kind of want to go through it, clean it out and organize it. Try to do this maybe like once a season. it's really not the best and I'm, I told you guys I'm not like an extremely organized person but this is what works for me so right here is where I keep like long dresses skirts stuff like that nicer tops that I want to hang and then cardigans and then going here this is where I keep just like some of my nicer sandals and loafers 
Then going up here, I just have Ag boots that I can't seem to get rid of that I'm just gonna keep. Um, boots, handbags. Then I have um, like belts and accessories and some sunglass cases. And then this one I have bathing suits and hats. Then it goes sneakers and then more sandals. And then going on this side, this is where I keep like all my jackets and sweaters. So it kind of goes from like casual, more like workout jackets to leather jackets, jean jackets, and then a bunch of fuzzy puffers and jackets, and then a bunch of sweaters. And then down here is where I keep all my jeans. So it goes from just like dark denim to light denim. I like to do it in color instead of by style, just because I more gravitate towards like what uh, wash I'm gonna wear and then up here is where I keep all of my boots and then some heels I hate heels so I don't have very many and they're all short and then down here is um where I keep extra handbags accessories boxes for handbags and things and then um this one is kind of like a memorabilia one of just like stuff Aaron's given me and pictures and things so yeah this is the overview and my miss is actually kind of cool I made this with my friend it's just a mood board but um which is funny because I didn't even realize I had that YouTube sign up there so I guess I wanted to start a youtube channel i didn't even realize i put that there but that's kind of cool um i still really want a black corgi that was so cute um but yeah it's kind of cool to see things that have happened this year things that didn't happen like coachella and things like that but you know like we got engaged there's wedding stuff in here so that's really cool so yeah but i'm getting dinner with a friend later so maybe i'll show you what i'm wearing for that and i'm just gonna put some more stuff away but i'm really happy that this is all organized because it was a disaster before hi guys so it is the next day it is thursday and i think i'm gonna end the vlog here just a day early i'm not really doing much tomorrow and i think i have a lot of footage but i just came back from crossroads like i showed you guys i dropped my stuff off there yesterday and i picked it up so i got some money back for my clothes which is exciting um everything that they didn't buy i kept and i will be listing it on my poshmark so look out for that i will leave my poshmark name right here or in the description box but i hope you enjoyed um this week's vlog and make sure to subscribe give this video a thumbs up and comment down below what videos you want to see next and i will see you guys next time bye